Now, yesterday, we talked uh, in Hot Topics about a nun who was excommunicated for allowing doctors to perform an abortion to save the mother's life. And the reaction we got from some people is kind of something we feel we should be addressing. You know, we got a lot of uh, emails that started, we don't watch your show. <laughs> but, now, but. if you're going to email us about something that you don't like on the show, perhaps you should watch it. <laughs> Number one. So you can get yeah. the entire yeah. story, and you can get what we said, as yeah. opposed to listening to somebody else who to just told clip. you to write a letter yeah. or a you clip. Know? And, uh, you know, I, I, a gentleman called William Donahoe, mm -hmm. uh, who is a interesting fellow, I have nothing ugly to say about him, but I will say that he, he wrote something about what we talked about yesterday and sort of got it all wrong. You know, we were talking about the fact that it bothered us that someone would excommunicate this nun for saving the life of the mother, of with the four mother children. who also has four children mm -hmm. who would be without her. We, yes. we talked about, we thought it was kind of rough. Yeah. And not right. And we also said that we thought, how odd. They allowed the pedophile priests to be moved around. And, never and they never excommunicated them. Right. That was our other point. Well, this gentleman decided that uh, we were crazy and that uh, we, were, we were not Catholics. That I have something yes. to say about. Yes, yes. I think we all do. Yeah. Now, yes. I, I was saying, I, you know, I know it's going to scare you, Bill. But, yes, I was a Catholic. I went to Catholic school, St. Columba, and I'm proud of it because I learned that God said, only I can forgive you. No one else can That's forgive right. you. If you have a problem, come to me because I'm God and I'm the only one who's got your back. Okay? And he also said, little Jesus, when he was <laughs> walking around, he saw Mary Magdalene and said, let he who is without sin cast the first stone. And I say that to you, Mr. Donahoe, because you felt it necessary to let people know that I had abortions and to give them the, the website to go to. Well, guess what? God and I worked it out, baby. And when I stand before him, That's right. I don't have anything to worry about. Can you say the same? I don't think so. <laughs> This guy, now that you mentioned his name, we, I guess yes. we have to say it. Mm -hmm. But he is constantly, I, I understand he's being paid by the Catholic Diocese or somebody is paying him to put the word out to all these people that we are bad. And not just us, other people, whoever criticizes the church in any way, he sends this missive out and then they get on everybody. Mm -hmm. And um, I also resent the fact that he says that I'm not Catholic. I was baptized a Catholic. Mm -hmm. My daughter was baptized a Catholic. I was married in a Catholic church. When I won to $250,000 on the Millionaire Celebrity mm -hmm. Show. I gave the $250,000 to the church so that they could buy computers for the Catholic school. Um, I kind of resent it. If you, so, in other words, if you have doubt, that makes you anti-Catholic? Right. And don't, no. don't, tell, don't tell us we've turned if our you, back I, on the Catholic Church. Yeah. Don't tell me I've done that. About, sorry. If you criticize the, the dogma a little bit or you say maybe this institution is not perfect, they, they want to excommunicate you, I have never been excommunicated. Mm -hmm. you know? no. So I am still a Catholic, Belle. And, and, I think, I, and I wish you would just stop saying things like that and making people angry And with I think us. if people get mad... And Merry Christmas, by the way. Merry Christmas. <laughs> but I think if people get, get angry with us because we get on men who've not been brought to task for attacking innocent children, mm -hmm. then you stay mad. Because that's what... They attacked yes. innocent children. Yeah, yes. I just think it's unfortunate, too. And it really it sort of cuts his point off at the knees when he uses vindictive words, um, hateful thoughts, and a pointed letter to try to condemn someone else for not being Catholic enough. And so it's just, you should yeah. take it's, that and measure it up against yourself. I think that it's, it was none of our business. it's dangerous to have people turning on us for no good reason. It's not fair. Well, you know what? This, it's, is, it's, this is one Christian. little man. It's one okay. little man wrote this letter, and he can just go it's, to... It's okay. Well, you know what? It's, it's okay because... You know, we have the right, and it's people like you, William Donahoe, that keep people like us away from the church. We'll be right back with more Hot Topics.